you cannot find a lot of um, companies in crypto space that will be Sharia compliant and uh, will align with all the values that Muslim community uh, actually follows. I started my journey in blockchain space like three years ago. Um, I used to work at uh, Blockchain Center. This is a crypto marketing agency that was um, a portfolio company of Animoca Brands. That's pretty uh, well-known um, GameFi ecosystem uh, at a blockchain space. So I started my journey there, was participating literally each and every event that you can imagine uh, regarding the blockchain, NFTs and uh, all those types of wonderful Web3 uh, space. And uh, after that, I uh, decided to change a bit uh, my angle and uh, from GameFi, I uh, focused on uh, blockchain ecosystem as Hack Network. I want to talk a little bit about Hack Network. Yeah. What is it that you do and what is it that makes you guys special? Uh, so Hack Network, that's the first ethical uh, blockchain ecosystem. And uh, actually what we do, we are bridging Islamic finance with Web3. So we are targeting uh, 2 billion Muslim people. Uh, so they uh, will be able to know more about Web3. Uh, we want to make it as much uh, transparent as we can for them, as much ethical, obviously Sharia compliant. And that's actually the main um, USP of our company that um, you cannot find a lot of um, companies in crypto space that will be Sharia compliant and uh, will align with all the values that Muslim community uh, actually follows. Mm -hmm. So onboarding potentially a large chunk of that 2 billion population uh, that you're talking about, is, is that the main driving force behind Hug Network? Obviously Mm, that's our main audience, but also we want to show all the world that Sharia compliant product can be accessible to each and everyone, doesn't matter what religion you are, because mm, this is something that actually can be very useful for everyone, because the main values um, of um, Sharia compliant product are mm, something that we follow every day, such as uh, being um, kind people, no violations, um, doing some charity. So all those simple rules that we are following actually applicable to each and every person. So why not to showcase this to everyone? Yeah. So in a, in a few words, then how would you summarize um, what Hack Network is doing to change or improve the blockchain space? Uh, well, uh, first of all, we are pretty big ecosystem. Um, our blockchain uh, EVM compatible. Uh, it allows uh, to developers and builders to um, actually like build uh, a lot of interesting products on our ecosystem. Uh, also, we are going um, into RVA space, uh, meaning that we really would like to show the people that tokenization of uh, Web2 products is real and this is something that can be very helpful so our main mission to understand everyone that uh, the this word crypto is not that bad as some people might think and this is something that you can use in daily life and this is something that also can be as i mentioned before sharia compliant and um, it will just make your life more easier and simple in the end of the day Perfect. So you, you mentioned um, Sharia compliance there, you mentioned some values, and you mentioned also RWAs. Tokenization yeah. is very much a hot topic at the moment. Yeah, correct. Um, and we were at the RWA summit a couple of days ago, very interesting conversations. Mm -hmm. I'm curious, um, beyond tokenization, what are some of the things you're working on that really excite you? Uh, personally, uh, my position in the company is chief operating officer, so my main responsibility to make sure that all the processes in the company will go smooth. So I'm making sure that uh, all our teams working together smoothly. So um, we're welcoming each and every partner who are coming to our company and I'll make sure that they uh, will have a proper response, will have a great connection with each other, will make 
a lot of um, great activities in uh, blockchain space in general. So, um, and yeah, I can say that I'm excited about what I'm doing, to be honest. Amazing. I'm, I'm certainly also excited here um, in Dubai. And I think there's a growing consensus that the UAE is really becoming the blockchain hub to be because of the regulatory improvements that they're making, because of the number of companies that are relocating here, professionals like yourself have relocated here. I'm curious, do you think the achievements of the UAE in these areas uh, can be duplicated elsewhere? That's a very good question. To be honest, I'm not... Um, uh, I personally used to live for the last five years in European Union, and um, I know that they are also doing a lot of improvements, but... Uh, rather than that, I still believe that Dubai is still the, the hottest spot for blockchain companies because it's still more easy than anywhere else in the world. And they did all the possible conditions uh, to move here. Uh, as a professional, for me personally, it was very easy to apply for a visa, um, to, to make the process of living here very smooth and easy. And, um, yeah, obviously, you know, about all the conditions in terms of taxes and everything that makes each and every company be very happy about save some money. So, um, and as you mentioned before, it's a huge crypto community here. So um, if you are new in the city, you can start your journey with going literally every day to different crypto blockchain events that are hidden here. I'm not sure that you can find uh, so many of them in any other country in the world, to be honest. I think you're right. I think you're right. So professionally, it makes sense. As a business, it makes a lot of sense. I'm curious, as an individual, what's your favorite part of being here? Uh, the favorite part, I believe that in this city, you can find everything. So you can actually find a work-life balance here. Um, so you have uh, different areas like Business Bend downtown uh, where you have a huge motivation to work. But on the other hand, you have um, a great beaches, amazing infrastructure um, in terms of um, lifestyle, how you can spend your time on weekends. Um, personally, for me, it's amazing that I can ride a bike literally everywhere. That's what I'm doing, actually. Uh, yesterday, I came to the conference on a bike and I came back as well on a bike. It's uh, super nice. And uh, you have all the possibilities to, to actually relax after a working day. And on the other hand, as I mentioned, you have a lot of motivation to work here. Uh, because all people came here to make this life different, you know, and it's very motivating. Would you then, would you recommend um, entrepreneurs, um, individuals, professionals, but specifically female entrepreneurs and professionals to relocate here to the UAE? hundred um, percent. As a female, I feel here very, very safe. For me, that's honestly the biggest thing. I feel that... Um, I can ride my bike uh, at 11 p.m. when it's already dark and I know that everything will be safe. Um, this is something that's very important. The, safe, the safety, this term in Dubai, on a such a high level, um, I, I know that if I'll be at a coffee place and I'll leave my stuff and we'll go, for example, for a rest to a restroom, nothing going to happen. Um, and believe me, as a person who used to live in European Union, this is something that I struggled. So, yes, it's very, very safe. Um, that's why I actually like this place. Perfect. I want to ask you what um, what we can look forward to in the next months, years from Hack Network. What sort of updates can we expect? Um, actually, the biggest update that's uh, going to happen in the nearest one, two months that we're going to launch our own gold stable coin. And I think this is something that's uh, going to be um, very interesting for all the market and especially for our community. Uh, so it will be a great showcase how you can actually connect, again, actually a real world assets to... Um, uh, crypto industry blockchain space. Mm -hmm. And where can we follow along with the developments and the progress and the updates of both yourself and the company? Um, 
we have literally all the socials. So uh, we have um, our main website, uh, hug.network. We are at Twitter, Discord, Telegram, uh, Snapchat, Instagram, very soon even on TikTok. Uh, so you can follow us everywhere, Hug Network. All the updates are there. Looking forward to staying updated. Thank you very much for making time to talk to us. Thank you. Appreciate it. <laughs>